Yo, what up? It's your boy Tyquan. What? What the? Hold on, let me just fix this. Cool. You know, after a year and some change, it's back. It's back. It's been a long time since I've done this. Story time with Tyquan is back. Now the last time I told a story, I told the story about when I had my first white girl and it was a terrible experience. She shitted on my dick. The bitch shitted in my bed. She shit. If you haven't seen that video, what are you doing? What are you doing? Today we're talking about the worst whooping I probably got in my whole entire life. So I was in elementary school when this happened. Um, I was probably about eight, nine years old. My mom was in me and my brother's room one night. And she was cleaning up our closet because you know kids are kids are pretty fucking dirty. My mom was cleaning up our fucking closet, and I, little old me, was in the room playing with toys as usual, preferably wrestling toys. As a young kid, I was very obsessed with tennis. Besides football, I was very obsessed with tennis and baseball. And I didn't really like light light tennis like that. I just had a tennis racket, and I like just hitting the balls with um my tennis. That sounds so nasty. That sounds so weird. But anyways, I had a tennis racket and I was hitting stuff with the damn tennis racket. My mom was already in a bad mood because she had to clean up me and my brother's up ass closet. And she did not like it not one bit, but we were her kids and she loved us. So she said, fuck it, I'm gonna clean it. If you mess it up again, I'm gonna fuck you guys up. No, that's not what she said. She was just mad as After, I don't know, maybe a little while of playing with toys, I started jumping in the bed and like that. Now the way our room was, it was just a regular square room. We had two windows. We had a window literally above our bed and there was another window to like the left of the room, the, the left of the room, and the closet was like towards my way. So there was like a little wall space in between the windows. I don't know what possessed me to pick up my tennis racket and just start hitting stuff up against the wall, but I had one of those bouncy balls. Now, y'all know the little rubber bouncy balls that just bounce all over the place? Yeah. Uh, back in the days, we had all kind of balls like that. So I had a giant ball. It was cool. It was like one of those gelatin balls, and it had a dolphin in the middle of it, because I, I remember this shit. It had a dolphin toy in the middle of the ball, and the bottom of the toy was blue because it represented the water and you know the top part was see-through clear so it's like as if the dolphin's just jumping out of water type shit. but i started smacking that fucking ball up against the wall so hard with my tennis racket like hard bam I, mean, I don't know why i was doing this shit, but i just started just whamming that shit, right so i did it like three times my mom goes boy if you bust out my window i'm gonna your ass up <laughs> i ain't gonna bust out the window mom I, i'm being careful wham Wham! So I'm hitting the ball again like a dumbass. My mom goes, if you bust out my window, I'm gonna f your little ass up. So I'm like, man, I ain't gonna bust out the window. Boom! Y'all know how Stone Cold Steve Austin song goes when, before he comes out? <laughs> All I heard was, <laughs> and next thing you know, like Stone Cold Steve Austin himself, my mama walked out of that closet with a hanger. She ain't had time to grab no belt, she grabbed a hanger. My mama whooped my ass so bad, bro. I'm trying to run and jump up under the bed. She done pulled me from under the bed. Wow, 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 I told you not to bust out my mother window. Da, 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 da. Mind you, here's what makes it worse. What makes it worse is we had neighbors that was across from us. When they heard the glass break, all I heard was, oh, f it. oh, f it. oh, f it. When my mama started whooping my ass, these motherfuckers laughing. <laughs> Whoop my fucking ass so bad, bruh, dog. Let me ask y'all folks out there who's to get whoopings. Y'all ever got a whooping so bad with a belt or with a anger, switch, broom, whatever. Y'all ever got a whooping so bad that y'all started playing with y'all whips at the end and y'all was mad as fuck. I'm fucking kill my mama, fuck my mama, fucking bitch, I'm gonna run away. <laughs> yeah, that was me. I wanted to run away. I wanted to leave. I went outside and started stepping on all the cracks outside because I wanted my mama back to fucking break. I was that fucking mad. But you know what? It was my damn fault because she told me to start hitting the ball in my dog. I said, listen. My mama fucked me up, but it was out of love, and it was to teach me not to do that shit again. And that's where we don't want to get things confused. That I know a lot of people in today's world are soft as fuck. They don't like whooping their kids because they feel bad, blah blah blah. 
Man, f all that. Shit. I'm not saying to abuse anybody. Don't abuse the kids. Don't beat them for no reason. We only got whoopers when we did something we wasn't supposed to do. My mama told me not to hit that ball up against the wall because I might bust the window out. And guess what? I bust the window out. So you know what happened? I got my ass whooped. And I learned don't hit balls in the house. Stay the fuck from the window. I learned. Whoopings made me into the man that I am now. I'm handsome. I'm 4'11. I'm. Shit. Broke. <laughs> no, for real. I'm a YouTuber. I'm very intelligent and I'm very smart. So, you know. Yeah. But anyways, y'all want to hear stories about me getting my ass whooped. That's one of the stories that I can think of. Now, there are more stories, too. This is your boy, Taquan. I hope you guys enjoyed the story, man. Y'all already know what to do. Drop your beautiful comments down below. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that little notification bell that's right next to the subscribe button because it's supposed to give you guys my notifications. And I don't know if you guys are going to my notifications because YouTube be with that bullshit. And also, and importantly, this is more important to me than anything. Hit the share button. Hit that share button. Share it across the world. Share with everybody. Let everybody see what you watch. You watch Taekwon. Taekwon. Taekwon the great. Taekwon the creator. Taekwon the content.